The Yamaha N-Max is one of Team Blue's best-selling small displacement scooters in Europe and Asia. In the market since 2017, the N-Max has seen a number of revisions, but has remained more or less identical to its original formula. This urban runabout basically takes the recipe to Yamaha's bigger Maxi Scoots, the X Max and T Max, and optimizes it for urban mobility at an affordable price point. Twenty twenty two model year. Yamaha has bestowed a few key refinements on the N-Max, making it even better than before. Priced at €3,499, or the equivalent of US$4,080, it continues to boast impressive value for money, particularly in Europe's dense urban cities. The revised N-Max 155 basically carries over all the styling updates of the recently updated N-Max 125 in the region. As such, it gets new LED lighting, more sporty bodywork, and slightly revised ergonomics. The seating position has been extended slightly to account for taller riders, while the bars now sit higher, providing a more comfortable and relaxed riding position. Yamaha has also increased the fuel capacity for the 2022 N Max, fitting it with a larger 7.1 liter fuel tank. Yamaha now claims a range of around 300 kilometers, provided, of course, that you go easy on the throttle. It continues to draw power from the liquid-cooled, fuel-injected, 155cc, single-cylinder motor we find in Yamaha's premium Asian lineup consisting of the YZFR15, MT15, and XSR155. This engine gets Blue Core technology optimized for Euro 5 compliance, as well as variable valve actuation VA, which tweaks valve timing for efficiency down low and performance up top. The N-Max claims an output of 15 horsepower. As far as techie features are concerned, the 2022 N-Max 155 comes fully equipped with a new communication control unit, CCU, which enables you to pair your shiny new scooter to your smartphone via Bluetooth connectivity. It integrates to your phone via Yamaha's My Ride mobile application, which allows you to view vital information such as service and maintenance schedules, battery health, and navigation and trip data. Last but not least, a 12V power socket and ample under-seat storage offer just a tad more practicality on long days on the saddle. The hot-selling Yamaha N-Max 155 has recently received some key refinements for the 2022 model. Limited to the European market, for now, the upgrades include styling enhancements, better ergonomics, and more electronic features. 
The new N-Max is priced at €3,499, approximately equal to RM16,886. The 2022 Yamaha N-Max borrowed styling upgrades from the recently revealed N-Max 125. It now features sportier bodywork and a refreshed LED headlight. These changes complement the already striking appearance of the bike. Further, Yamaha revised the frame of the bike for a better seating position, keeping in mind the tall riders. It has been extended slightly, and the bars are now placed higher for a comfy and relaxed riding posture. In terms of electronics, the new N-Max benefits from a new communication control unit, CCU, which allows riders to pair their smartphones with the scooter via Bluetooth connectivity. By downloading Yamaha's My Ride mobile app, riders can check important information about the vehicle like battery health, navigation trip data, on their phone. At the bike's core lies the Euro 5 compliant 155cc liquid-cooled, fuel-injected, single-cylinder engine mated to blue core technology and variable valve actuation. It churns out a maximum power output of 15 horsepower and a peak torque of 14.4 Nm. The power is sent to the wheels via a V-belt automatic transmission unit. The 2022 model also gets a larger fuel tank measuring 7.0 liter, upgraded from 6.6 liter, that provides a range of 300 kilometers according to Yamaha. Yamaha has introduced the newly updated 2022 N-Max 155 moto scooter for the European markets. The scooter closely relates to the Yamaha Aerox 155 which was launched in the Indian market very recently, as both derive power from the company's new sports bike, YZFR 15 V4. For 2022, Yamaha has given the scooter some subtle changes inside out to make it more modern and appealing for the younger set of buyers. The Japanese automaker has tweaked the looks of the scooter thanks to the touches such as the new LED headlamp, lower placed handlebar, and minor exterior body updates. The company has repositioned the handlebar to make the turning of the scooter easier. In addition to that, the ergonomics have also been tweaked minorly. The scooter now gets a longer fuel range, claimed, of 300 kilometers thanks to its larger fuel tank which can accommodate 7.1 liter of fuel at once. In terms of the powertrain, it continues to source the engine from the R15 V4 Sports bike. This is a 155cc, liquid-cooled, single-cylinder engine that has been rated to churn out close to 15 bhp of maximum power. This engine comes with Yamaha's variable valve actuation VA, setup. The scooter sports a range of modern features such as Bluetooth connectivity which enables the rider to pair the vehicle with the rider's smartphone. This allows the user to access information such as navigation, trip details, and maintenance service schedules through Yamaha's smartphone application. The N-Max also comes with a 12V charging socket for more convenience. 
It might not be introduced in the Indian market anytime soon since the company already has the Aerox 155 which stands in the same segment as the NMAX 155. That said,